Greetings everyone, Looney Farm Guy here with a new update video test <laughs> uh, to the Old Cow Barn by Raz, uh, Razek. Uh, it's 6.99 megabytes to download, 23 slots on console. Now, in my original um, review test of this cow barn, uh, there were some issues and we're going to retest uh, a few of these things. We're not going to go over every detail. If you want to look at the original, uh, view the original um, uh, test, I'm going to link the video in the description. However, um, if we take a look at it in our uh, animals and go over the change log 1.1, it says mod desk version increased. Not sure what that is. Number of animals fixed. I don't remember having a problem with the animals, but 150 animals go in this cow pen. And food is now unloaded in the stable. Now, I do remember something about um, possible issues with that. Um, however, I've uh, been testing it now, and uh, we will show you a few things. Now, the, uh, the food trigger is here. Um, the straw trigger is here. We have a milk output water in here. The um, animal uh, dialog box by thingy. <laughs> What's it called? The animal dialog. Yeah, is right here. And let's see here. We still not making any manure. That's odd. Hmm. Let's uh, let's put down a different. Uh, let's put down a silo extension. No, that. Not sure why it's not producing any manure. Right. Okay. So maybe that's odd. So okay, we'll test that again. However, um, the roof uh, area is very limited so types of vehicles trailers and so forth are going to be tight going in there however um, if you use one of these mix wagons as um, suggested I do believe uh, suggested by uh, a viewer and often commenter on my uh, videos uh, Mr. Domination uh, suggested that uh, feed mixer is well in, in tight restricted areas, um, obviously a feed mixer is something you mix feed in and you feed your cattle with. And it's like, well, yeah, of course. And as we can show here, uh, it works very well. And typically that's what you would uh, kind of see in a situation like this anyways, where a feed mixer comes in and dumps the feed into the trough. So very nice. Uh, works very well. Uh, they're not. There's probably a, some bigger capacity ones out there, but uh, I thought that was a very nice suggestion, very good solution that kind of passed me by when uh, doing these tests and complaining about how small the roof or how low the roof was. Right. So now the next question is: uh, Will it take bales of grass and uh, grass and hay for feed? And uh, yes, indeed, uh, that was a uh, hay bale, I believe. And this is, yes, a grass. And uh, yeah, they pretty much instantly disappear. I, I seem to remember having trouble with the straw before, but now if you can see, uh, the straw bales are right here and they will disappear. Now, another thing I thought of is like, well, what if you're having trouble getting the straw bales in there or whatsoever don't forget these uh these mixing wagons take straw and uh you don't need a straw blower let's get it back in there isn't there we go so uh, as you can see it's turning it into straw loose straw and if we go forward it's chewing up that bale and now yeah, I'll back it up, back it up. There we go. Now we can throw the uh, loose straw in there, like so. So uh, yeah, no problems if you have bales and you want to convert them into uh, loose straw. 
Um, a mixing wagon will do that for you very nicely. Right, so how about the other triggers? Well, the water trigger, I filled the water up here. Uh, it works very well. Let's check, uh, let's test the milk trigger. We have some milk. And that works, as you can see, it fills up very quickly, very nicely. And slurry, uh, the doesn't tell you how much slurry in the pen information, which is somewhat disappointing. That is a very helpful, um, a f helpful number. Although if you look at the, see, looking at the cow barn large, bottom right corner there, says slurry, there's 31,250. So if you look at the, basically the field information while looking at the cow pen, it will tell you there, but it would have been nice to add that in the um, information on the uh, the uh, in the menu. <clears throat> and as you can see, that fills up very nicely. So now we're going to just double check to make sure this is producing manure. So we're going to run over, sleep again, and just make sure we have uh, manure production. All right, so after a lot of finagling, we got it to produce manure. However, I had to override the, um, um, do the whole triangle, you know, because it says it's too close to something. I had to put it very close to the barn for it to actually work. So just so you know that, uh, I think you'll be able to get some manure. The other problem I do notice, it runs out of food and water very quickly so you're gonna to have to keep on top of that uh, very closely otherwise everything seems to be working as it should so there you go that is your um, old cow barn by Razek it's the update uh, for Wednesday July the 24th I'm Lonely Farm Guy and remember it's only a game till next time bye for now